This service is a two-year pilot in Dundee and Fife to support people who are in work and struggling with health issues, are off sick from work or are unemployed up to six months. The team comprises of various clinicians who provide services such as physiotherapy, counselling and mental health support and also workplace adjustments. We also offer support and advice for employers. The service is easy to access by phoning the national number or you can refer through the web page. This service is based at King's Cross Health and Community Care Centre, however people can be seen in venues within their communities if that's more convenient. Now what we do is help individuals who have health issues while working, are off sick as a result of health issues and unemployed up to a maximum of six months. We provide case management approach to interventions by carrying out a comprehensive assessment and at the end of the day we mutually agree with the individual for a recommendation or action plans that can help them to improve chances of employability or help the, you know, if it's musculoskeletal difficulties to be able to get back into work and where necessary mental health interventions as well. They come in the form of physiotherapy interventions, occupational therapy for workplace adaptations and counselling where appropriate. Case managers are also trained in the areas of talking therapies as well. Now the idea is early interventions improve the chances of individuals staying at work. Also, the more people are working, the less likely they are prone to be you know, exposed to gross poverty. Counselling helps by offering a space to talk that is safe, non-judgmental and with a few exceptions, completely confidential so that the client can feel completely free to talk openly and honestly about their situation. The sessions are arranged in advance with the client and they usually last for about 50 minutes. The number of sessions that they may require will be discussed with them when they start the process. So whether they are in work, currently off work or recently unemployed, as a counsellor I can help them to look at their situation and where possible support them to find solutions to their problems and to cope better with the existing difficulties that they may be experiencing in their workplace, their home life or both. My role um, in relation to the Health and Work Support Pilot Project has been basically as the person patients consult with either uh, musculoskeletal problems or um, psychological problems and I've been signposting them for help and support with um, the presenting complaint and I think it's uh, been really successful because mainly both of these types of um, services, psychology and physiotherapy, have been particularly plagued by very long waiting times. So I think it's helped to keep patients in work and it's also helped to get patients back to work um, and other patients who weren't off sick at all they um, have improved their health. So within the, the Health and Work Support Service, um, the occupational therapist is interested in how, um, the, how work is impacting a, a person's health condition, but also looking at the, the home side as well. Um, I, I'm looking at sort of the, the physical and the, the mental health, um, or, or sort of both, both sides of it. So one of the things the occupational therapist can do is um, a workplace assessment. Um, so a, a person's work environment be, may be um, exacerbating their, their health symptoms. So an occupational therapist can go out, um, assess the, the environment and make recommendations about sort of equipment, postures, adaptations that can be made. Um, occupational therapists can also work with people that are um, having difficulties with sleep, um, fatigue, pain, um, difficulties with work-life balance. Um, can do a range of different things like problem solving, goal setting, um, looking at wellness plans, um, self-management strategies, education about how, um, how the health conditions are affecting the person. The support provided includes identifying workplace risks and hazards, assessment of working environments and display screen equipment, manual handling concerns, reasonable adjustment discussions, assistance with policy development and general health at work information and support. Uh, my role involves working with patients who have physical disabilities. Um, these disabilities may have occurred through injury, illness, disability or ageing. And really what I'm aiming for is to help patients maintain or regain their movement, their activity or their ability to remain at work or return to work. 
told to contact the service to uh, get treatment for the physio from the physiotherapy uh, and also to get advice as to where to move on to from there through other agencies. Uh, very easy uh, process. It was um, quite uh, quick uh, and easy to get into. Uh, just a quick phone call to the service, uh, got assessed uh, and then uh, got invited to come along to the physiotherapy session.